further investigations have revealed a less glamorous side to manicures that is hushed by many salons worldwide due to the fact that it's highly illegal in several states across America. The substance is called methamethacrylate, liquid monomers, more commonly known as MMA. The dangerous chemical is deemed as poisonous by the FDA, yet despite it being banned in 30 states, it is still widely present in cosmetic nail preparations throughout the country. MMA is a bonding agent used in big capital words in artificial nail products used in the early stages of the professional nail industry mma referred to as dental acrylic or porcelain nails was commonly used in professional nail products by the end of the 1970s however the fda has received so many complaints that it was forced to take action against several manufacturers mma is poisonous and it will MMA is poisonous okay you have the right to ask the nail technician what product they are using if a nail salon has suspiciously discounted prices be wary of its ingredients MMA has a strong irritating chemical odor sharp and fruity when I was falling over it, it smelled like rotten eggs that does not smell like other acrylic liquids. As such, the nail technician will often wear a mask. Well, we wear a mask for a lot of reasons. One of them for me to, for the dust. Keep a watchful eye out for warning signs. After application, the product will set much harder, feels less flexible, and be very difficult to file. I want my nails coughing. I say do them coughing. It can't be done. The nail extensions are very, are virtually impossible to remove with normal solvents. So you may have to pick or pry or drill it off. As an added bonus, it's the cheapest option, one third the price of other alternatives. Nail kits sold at retail outlets were also found to contain the chemical. The use of MMA is not illegal for no reason. According to, the, according to the United States Department of Labor, the industrial use of MMA, industrial use of MMA, industrial use of MMA has been associated with adverse health effects in some people, including irritation of the eyes, nose, throat, and respiratory tract. Repeated exposure results in drowsiness, dizzy spells, and trembling of the hands. As if that's not bad enough, prolonged usage may contribute to damage and deformities in nail growth. Permanent loss of the nail plate, loss of sensation, and fingertips have been reported. And also issues with, um, I, I don't know why I didn't print out, also issues with um, receiving, um, with having babies also. This is something that I got off the internet. You have to read. I went through bad experience with MMA back in the day when I didn't know what it was. I still have reactions to it now. Well, this is what happened to me. My face, uh, I still have issues with my face. So basically what they were saying was MMA, MMA sets like this. You can't file it. Just because it's sold in a nail supply store doesn't mean you have to buy it. This is something I just made up. This is my logo on a... On a on a label. If I wanted to, I could have said, stay with their studio, elegant foot file. Did they go over y'all head? Yeah, this is a cheese grater. Also, about the picture I posted, let me hurry up, I don't want this video to be so fast. A lot of the pictures still went over a lot of you guys' heads also that I posted on my page. The container says, mango liquid. Okay, it says spa. Okay, it says good for all seasons. Okay, it says sculpture liquid, super adhesion. Okay, it says non yellowing. Okay, and at the bottom it says methyl methaculate. But all y'all focused on is the price. Y'all saw that $65 and get ready to grab it. They flying under the radar and not getting in trouble because they didn't say it's um, nail liquid. It doesn't say use for nails. Y'all bought it, they didn't tell you to buy it. 
just because they made their own label, switched it out and put it on something that's MMA, they can get in trouble for that because, again, it's in the nail supply store, so what? It says in, in small letters, methamethacrylate, it says MMA. So just because it's sold in the nail supply store or whatever, doesn't mean that that's for the nail. A gallon of nail liquid, EMA, methacrylate, is almost $200. So, listen to this video again and share this video and read and be mindful of what you're doing because even though you bought it somewhere, you used it and somebody get an infection or lose, use, lose their fingertips or whatever, they can sue you. So, yeah, thanks for watching.